Hey, what's up, mannequins? Welcome back and welcome to all my new subscribers. Welcome, welcome, welcome. It's Sugar Miss Money, baby. I am coming to you all today with leftover seafood boil. And then I have spicy noodles um, that I got from some Korean place. And they look, I taste them, they hot. So, I got some spicy noodles. And I have some leftover be love sauce. Um, I added these little crab legs that I had left over from another boil that was in my freezer. I needed to go ahead and eat them. And my leftover food from yesterday because I didn't eat it when I came in from the club last night. So, we're just going to go ahead and get started. Heavenly Father, I come before you in the name of Jesus, and I thank you for this food that I'm about to receive. I ask that you make a nourishment to my body, take out the bad, and leave in the good. I also ask that you bless the cook. I also ask, Lord, in your name, that whoever is in need of a meal right now, Lord, that some kind of way you make it possible. In Jesus' name I pray. Amen. 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 So, y'all, we're going to go ahead and get started. Notice her. So I don't have on no lip stuff today because I'm about to smash. Ooh, this is getting on my nerve. Cause I am about to smash this. Hurt my face. So yeah, I'm trying chopsticks. Hmm. I'm about to try and follow it. Oh, they hot. Ooh. Got my handy dandy water. Oh, that's hot. So, get a place for my trash. So, let me. Go ahead and eat a potato first. That big old potato. Let me eat a potato first because I am very rebellious. And somebody left in my comments. Um, I I think I eat nice and neat, but I eat too slow. And why eat a potato first when you know it's going to get you full? Just eat the lobster first. <laughs> B. That first potato bite was for you. I 
I run this channel, how you gonna tell me what to eat first? You gotta knock it off. Mm -mm -mm. Mm -mm -mm. I don't like authority. That's why I'm my own boss. I ain't good with people telling me what to do. I just had a lemon. I don't know what I did with it this one. Yesterday I had food running, I mean juice running all down my neck. Y'all didn't tell me. Them noodles hot.
So yeah. Which do y'all prefer? Costco or Sam's? It was a lady in my comments. She told me that she got three of these big crab legs. From Sam's, it was three of them for like seventy-two dollars. And I got two this side for twenty. Now I know I wasn't reading this sign wrong. It said nineteen ninety-nine, and it was above this. So I don't know if they had to sign wrong or what. Oh, I could have looked at my receipt, but I threw my receipt away already. Oh, I can do a thumbnail. It's all right. I get one out the video. Got him. I've never been in Costco. And I would like to know which one y'all like this. Costco or Sam's. I heard their membership is higher than Sam's. Thank you. Tummy, tummy, tummy. Mm. These hot.
Oh. come out. I'm trying to be an experiment. I'm trying to be an experienced mm -mm -mm. Thank you for all y'all feedback. I'm the uh, weight loss surgery. I can't wait to have it done. I guess I'm going to have to vlog. <laughs> Since everybody's talking about I ain't going to be able to eat. Yeah, my daily life's so boring. I don't do nothing. Nothing at all. Y'all can watch Lifetime with me. <laughs> oh, I cracked myself up. Well, that's all I do. On a daily basis. Makeup. Home, lifetime. Mm. Tell y'all, it'd be the story. How I got into doing makeup. So when I got hurt back in twenty oh six. Yeah, I had to. Flawless face. No scars, no marks, no nothing. I like to make up, but I never really wore it a lot. And when I got hurt. Back in 06. Took me a long time to heal. I wasn't feeling pretty. Or none of that. And one day, I think I was watching YouTube. I've been doing makeup since I was in ninth grade. But not professionally. And so one day I was watching YouTube, and then when I was watching YouTube, I seen a tutorial. And I was like, hmm. And then I saw a lot of um, videos where people were saying they didn't feel pretty, and they had scars. And they wanted to give up. And so, I decided to do a makeup tutorial and see how I go. So I started, I did the makeup tutorial. I started doing um, what do you call it? Howls. Um, stuff that I would buy from the makeup store. And that's how my makeup channel came about. <clears throat> but the makeup community 
on YouTube. It used to be fun. But nowadays it's it's more competitive. People want to compete against each other and knock each other down, talk about each other. How you talk about somebody on YouTube you don't even know? So, it just started getting real competitive. and It wasn't fun anymore. So I stopped posting as much. One time I didn't post for a year. And then I missed it, went back. It was still the same. Bull is. So I stopped posting again later on. After some months. I didn't post for a year. That's why my channel over there haven't grown a lot because I don't like to deal with bull and drama. People trying to knock you down. Nobody didn't F with me. I just didn't like the fact how they were doing each other. And you can talk to a makeup guru, ask a question or anything. They won't even answer you back. They get real bullheaded when they get up, 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 up. They get real, real bullheaded. I don't think they're better than everybody. So. Me and another YouTuber, we would talk and text and we would all say the same thing. It just wasn't fun anymore. People are very competitive. You start out small and you end up big. And you get bored headed. You don't answer people questions. I don't need no question answered, but I would see other comments like where people ask them questions. They wouldn't come in back. So yeah. Then I started this channel. Just recently. And I haven't been posting over on the makeup channel. Mm. I don't know if I'm going back. Mmm. I'm through my leftover lobster. Mm. It's like Lunch time right now. So, what's left? I'll eat for dinner. Because I ain't going to reheat it up on Sunday. Today is going to be it for it. I did better with my left hand than I do with my right. I don't like them little. They some kind of Asian spicy, spicy noodles. Ugh. Ugh. I don't like them. So yeah, that's how I got into makeup, like professionally. Self taught. I already knew how to do makeup. I used to watch. All the little cheerleaders in the ninth grade, they sit in front of the gym mirror and um, do their makeup and stuff. And I'll be down there with them, child, doing makeup. And I've always had a passion for it. And when I saw that YouTube story, I just started doing it. And I 
I just have a net for it. And in Texas, you don't have to have a license to do makeup, so it's nice to have, but you don't have to have it. <clears throat> All right, you guys, I'm through with this. And after I eat it for dinner, I ain't doing seafood for about three, four days, five or six. <laughs> Ooh, it's a big old lobster. So yeah, you guys, I am too. Mm. I better get all the good eating I can get for now. And when I had this surgery, it's gonna be a wrap for a minute. For a while. <laughs> all right, if you have not became a mannequin, go ahead and hit the subscribe button and become one. Also hit that like button because you like seafood, leftover seafood, We don't talk about that. Or if you just love Miss Money, baby. Also hit that notification bell so that you can get a ding, ding every time I upload a video. And also don't forget to comment down below because you want to know that I live to come in back. And on that note, you guys, I'm about to get out of here. I love you. Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm.